product development was an idea that sparked a conversation at the Think Through Tactical headquarters in 2019. We knew that creating an image behind passion would be the biggest focus in developing a product, so we established a blueprint. With our creative ideas, we started to work behind the curtains in fulfilling the overall goal of expanding Think Through Tactical in every dimension. Combine those things, and the mission was simple. Develop a design constructed to fit most popular layouts at an affordable price. Given how the economy is going and inflation continuing to rise, we figured this can benefit most of the gun community. The result? Enter the Gambit. The conclusion is that we created a footprint that gives the customer the option to fit a broad range of weapon systems while harnessing all the qualities of an efficient holster. We knew that launching a holster that's capable of running different setups would be ideal for the OWB platform because it gives new shooters the options to try out different setups for personal preference. It also gives you the opportunity to become comfortable with how to operate a firearm while learning a new setting, but most importantly, learning a new mindset with preparation for the option of carrying out in public. Since this channel was first introduced, most of our audience targets the new shooter, and we feel it would be in the best interest of the operator to practice a wide variety of options while saving some extra cash. And since safety is the number one key when practicing self-sufficient weapon mechanics, we constructed a secure and reliable holster to give the shooter confidence when executing new skill sets. Retention plays a significant role when utilizing the draw stroke from the holster when employing weapon mechanics. Consistency with each draw stroke is the difference maker when it comes to longevity. This is why we took our time with the testing of the stress of the Gambit's retention system. We understand that eventually these holsters will be in people's hands, and the last thing we want is a broken system that could potentially put others at a harmful risk. So we came up with a simple two-point adjustable retention structure that we know will be a success in the gun community. This method gives you the option to run your setup according to your preference. Need to tighten up the retention because the gun class you're taking may involve physical contact? You can make adjustments with the screwdriver rotating the two screws clockwise. The same method can be used going in the opposite direction if you need to loosen up for some slack. Another significant quality that we had to attack in order to create a proficient draw stroke is the ergonomic configuration of an OWB holster. The cuts around the gambit are not only built around the weapon's mechanics, but it's also built around the operator's grip, making the clearance adaptable for user preference add our flared entrance design, and it makes the reholstering method easier to locate. We wanted to minimize the error margin of potentially fumbling a loaded firearm when trying to seat it in the holster, so we spent some time finding the right entry width to specify according to the weapon system. We also wanted to give the operator access to the mag release button without having to remove the firearm from the holster. We feel that it's in the operator's duty to control all of the important mechanics that assist the firearm in the ready position, so we constructed a cut on the backside of the gambit where the magazine release is located. Implementing all of these important factors creates efficiency when trying new skill sets, but so does the cosmetic side of the holster as well. With red dots playing a bigger role in the EDC realm, we've also implemented optic cuts to the Gambit holster. This will be the standard for all our holsters, so even if you don't have an optic now, you will have the real estate to add one down the road. One particular option that we've added to the Gambit is the ability to run a threaded barrel. We know that it can be a hassle finding a holster that can possess this feature, so we're also making this the standard for all our holsters in the future. For mounting options, we decided to mold our setup to Safari Land's QLS system. Their quick locking system is a popular reliable foundation that most gun owners use to mount their holsters to. We've adopted their blueprint because you can also run some of their other alternatives such as their injection molded paddle using the same footprint located on the Gambit holster. For a more in-depth breakdown on Safari Land's QLS system, I'll have some links in the description. So the big question, what holster setups are we launching that will be available on the website? As of now, our Gambit holsters is available in all Glock 9mm and 40 cal compact full-size competition in the light adaptable configuration. You get the option to run the Glock in the Surefire X300 or the Streamlight TLR1HL configuration. The primary focus was to produce the most common weapon system out on the market today. With Glock being the popular vote and 9mm being the common round, we went ahead and molded our footprint around that layout. As more and more people are starting to run weapon lights as a part of their OWB setup, we took the initiative to add the two most popular light systems to the Gambit holster. As for pricing, we try to keep it in the budget range so you can have the opportunity to pick up other items on other sites if needed. For those asking for holster color options, we'll have a limited amount, but we expect to add more in the upcoming phases. For available holster color selections, you can go to thinkthroughtactical.com or you can click the link below. So, with the launch underway, we're already scrambling to duplicate this exact formula for other models we plan on releasing on the second phase of the launch. The goal is to eventually produce every common holster that's compatible for every weapon system. In the meantime, if there is a particular setup that you're looking for, feel free to drop a comment in the comment section. 
Researching and launching particular holsters in the order of the customer's demand is our mission. If you end up picking up a holster from the website, feedback would greatly be appreciated. This will give us the opportunity to learn from it and will help us grow within the community. You can leave feedback in the Help Contact tab on our website. Introducing the Gamut Holster to the gun community was a two-year mission that was spent countless hours perfecting the mechanics, and I'm confident in saying that I stand behind our Gambit OWB design. Adding another safe system to the 2A community has always been the goal. If you're watching this video, then it's official. The Think Through Tactical Gambit Holster is now live on the website. Until then, I'm going to wrap this video up. To watch more content like this in the future, click the subscribe button. To get instant updates for the latest PPU content, click the bell notification icon as well, and I'll see you guys in the next video.